what is going on guys welcome back to the very first ever on the channel world cup vgc battle the way that this is uh gonna work is that world cup is a tournament that we're holding online for those of you who followed me during npa i didn't play actually but for those of you who follow npa um it's a similar style of tournament where it's a team tournament eight players from each team play each week the only difference is that it's based on region so i am representing the u.s east region i'm actually the captain of the team and i'm super excited the team is awesome i'm really excited for this but unlike npa the captains actually get to play and so that's why we're here right now this week we're going up against spain and i'm going to be playing a player named greenway who's from spain um i believe he's actually been around for a while the name is really familiar to me but i'm not totally sure um and if you are looking at the screen you can see it actually says flat rules and that is because this is vgc 15 this is a vgc 15 match it's gonna be two out of three so um i hope you guys enjoy it's been a while since i played vgc 15 but i always thought it was it was pretty fun so yeah i think we're just gonna go ahead and, and jump right into it wow yes let's go so good luck to green man good luck to spain um this should be interesting again i haven't really played in a while but let's see so this uh opponent has Aegislash, slash thunderous landers volcarona kangaskhan and milotic and i'm using my lancaster regionals team so thunderous is annoying right we don't like thunderous my thunderous looks pretty good my thunderous looks really good here i forgot how to play this team um landers looks good but he has my low tick kangaskhan looks good do i want kangaskhan or gardevoir they're both pretty solid he doesn't really have anything for a Zoomerl. I think I'll try and set up with a Zoomerl at some point. That looks solid to me. Um, hmm. Let's try. I think I like Kangaskhan here. And I think I like Kangaskhan up front. Um, I really do like Thunderous here. I wonder if I can get away without using... I, I don't know how to beat Kangaskhan without... Hmm. Hmm. We can try this. Let's try this. I need to watch out for his Kangaskhan. That looks like a really high priority for me to remove. Um. Yeah, I guess Landris is probably a Salt Vest. My Lota could be anything. Volcarona could be Rage Powder Support. Um, Aegislash. Oh, I don't have anything for Aegislash. Maybe I should bring Landris. Landers probably has to come in this matchup. Um, okay, fine, we'll do this. Oh, that's a oh, I'm out of time. Okay, I can't do that. Shoot! Oh, that's so unfortunate. Ran out of time. Um, not totally timed out, but I didn't have time to change. So, I think what I brought is still solid. I'm just gonna have to be super careful. Once again, it's um, Kangaskhan, Genies, Volcarona, Aegis Slash, Milotic. So, let's think about this one. I actually think Gardevoir is a place here as well. <laughs> oh boy, Thunderous and Kangaskhan, great. <laughs> oh, very nice. <laughs> um, okay. That's not too bad. Um, I think what's important to think about here is the fact that I would really love to get his Kangaskhan off the field. And I don't think he's likely to... Oh, if I had Landorus, this would be so good. I don't think that from his end, he's likely necessarily to fake out my Kangaskhan. I think what he could do is switch his Thunderous into Landorus and go from there. Um, I think I also could have fake outed his... Kangaskhan. I think my fake outing his Kangaskhan would actually not be bad at all. Um, yes. I think I do need to watch out for- Oh, Thunderous can run safety goggles. Oh my goodness. I'll need to check the item on that Thunderous at some point. That's going to be pretty important. Um, yes, he's considering his move. So in terms of this matchup, I think what I need to do is- I have a Zoomerl and a Moongus in the back. So I think what I want to do is set up for an Azumarill sweep. I feel like that's the general plan with his team. Because um, he doesn't have a ton for it. He does have that Milotic, but- a plus six Azumarill can still deal with my Lotic, so I just kind of have to think about how I'm going to get there. Um, I do have Kangaskhan for support, and I have Amoongus for support. I did bring Thunderous here. I'm not sure Thunderous is the best play. I did like that it was immune to Thunder Wave, um, but yes. We haven't learned anything yet. All we've learned is that, yes, so that should be Landorus, I believe. Um, yeah, that's definitely Landorus. <laughs> yeah, okay. All skill, no luck. So when he leads double genies, no luck, all skill. Both are good. Um, so when he leads double genies, he can do that. So, yeah, that's expected. We, we both switched out of Thunderous. We're probably both attacking the other Kangaskhan. Um, hopefully, I'm going to go first. Um, hopefully, I'll win the speed tie and then critical hit his Kangaskhan. That'd be really nice. Um, but, of course, you can't win them all. He could be bulky. I wouldn't be super surprised if he was bulky. As I recall, BGC15 doesn't have a ton of bulky Kang. But, you know, like, it's just one match. So he could definitely be bulky. So let's take a look at what happens here. Okay, I've won two speed ties, so it is a possibility that he's bulky. I don't know my damage calc, so I don't know if that's supposed to do that amount, but we're going to find out. Um, and he goes for a low kick as well into my Kangaskhan. So good turn one from both of us. Ooh, that did a lot. Oh, because I didn't intimidate him. Ooh, that was bad. That was very bad. 
Or maybe not. Maybe not indeed, Wolfwick. Huh, okay. Zoom will definitely come in here. Um, I don't know my damage calcs well enough to know whether or not this should pick up the KO. Um, the thing that interests me here is that... Hmm. Hmm. What do I want to do? The thing is that I can really safely go for a Rage Powder Belly Drum. And I don't see what he can do to stop it. So, the thing is, he can't Earthquake. Unless he, he can Earthquake, but he will knock out his Kangaskhan. So, um, I think I'll do this. I feel like he could switch Kangaskhan out as well. I don't think, like, maybe Kangaskhan to Thunderous and, like, Earthquake. I think that would be a solid play. Um... Yeah, I think that'd be actually be a really solid play. I need to, the thing is like the fact that the Thunderous could hold the safety goggles, but probably like Slash might not be. He doesn't have a ton for a move on his team. Oh, he has Volcarona and Age Slash. This is a tough one. This is actually a super tough one. I'm not really sure uh, what's going on here. Losing Kangaskhan might not have been good. I don't. I'm surprised I got KO'd by Low Kick. Oh, he's adamant. No, he, no, no, no. He might not be. I don't know if he's adamant. I don't know. I, I like it's it's been too long since I've since I've done that, but I thought my Kangaskhan would live that low kick. Um but it doesn't matter. Kangaskhan's gone now and positioning wise, I don't think I'm in that bad of a position. Um quite honestly. I'm not in a good position, but I'm not in that bad of a It depends what Kangaskhan does here. If he attacks into my zoom roll or my Amoongus. I would hope a zoom roll. So he does go for Oh, it's Scarf. Okay, good to know. Scarf. Oh, but it could be bulky. Ah, this sucks. Okay. Yeah, I figured he'd go for a rock slide. Double edge. Oh no. Okay, fine. Why did that do so much? Why did that do so much? Why is it doing so much damage? What on earth? Whew. Okay, this is going really badly. Oh, he's dead. Okay, this didn't go very well. This didn't go very well at all. I got bopped. I knew I should have brought Landorus. Oh, that was that was bad. Okay, cool. So I'm down 4-2. I don't I didn't learn anything important. Um I could have just rage powder belly drummed and like been in a really solid position, but I got, I got, I don't know if I got greedy. I think I got greedy. Huh. Um. And his Thunderous can def, or his, um, Landorus can, okay, I'm gonna assume that it's, I'm gonna assume that it's not Scarf, and that, that it's, um, bulky, 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 um, oh, actually, I don't, I don't, uh, do we think it's Scarf? We're gonna find out. No, we're not. Oh, wrong one, wrong one. Oh, that was so stupid. I'm so sorry, guys. I'm playing like an idiot. I forgot I wasn't boosted. <laughs> yeah, this is not. This is a questionable play to be sure. Um, ah, oh, this isn't gonna KO. This isn't gonna come close to KO. Great. So I've learned nothing. That was such a bad play. I'm shocked at how bad that was. This is actually too much damage. Yeah. Rip. Okay. This didn't go very well at all. Okay, I don't know any damage calcs is what I've learned. I, I literally have, like, no zero damage calcs. Why is this doing so much damage? Why is everything doing so much damage? Okay, fine. Let's find out if Thunder is... Let's find out the items, if we can. Damn, I got bopped. Okay, cool. All right, cool. So, th this didn't go very well. I got bopped. Um, but I feel like I'm in a pretty solid, like, understanding-wise position. So, he's not Scarf Lander, so let's find out if he's Citrus. He's definitely bulky... I don't think I found out if he's Citrus. Oh, it doesn't activate in time. I should have done that in the last turn. Okay, so he's probably Assault this Landorus and Citrus Thunderous. Okay, now now I feel like I have enough information to be playing this correctly. So, um, that didn't go very well, to be honest. <laughs> um, but the, it's a 2 out of 3, and I've gotten a lot of information. So, um, thank you guys so much for watching. If you enjoyed this battle, please make sure to leave a like. I know it was a little, a little quicker than maybe we would hope, but uh, I don't know. I'm going to try and bring it back in the next two games. Um, if you're interested in World Cup, you can learn more online. And, yeah, I guess I'll see you guys for game two.